going on? What is all this? What's that awful smell? Are you okay? I... I have no idea. Who are you? Jesse! Jesse! Where are you? Say something, Jesse! We're over here! No way! No way! You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? We need to get out of here now! This way! Jesse! You made it! And... Gabriel? Did you say Gabriel? Look out! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch. I'd be condemning them to death! Soren, what do you think you're doing? These Endermen are running directly into danger. You're putting us in danger every second you just stand there! <laughs> Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! She's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not gonna be able to outrun it. Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster. We're all gonna be caught in the tractor beam. Can we build a portal? If somebody has the right materials. We don't. I haven't seen Obsidian since the end. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! Jesse, we got this. We'll take the reins, and they can just hang on. I've got Petra! Then I'll take Gabriel. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. Come on, horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! I looked. Everyone, follow me! <laughs> this is Jesse, the worst look ride out. of my life! Axel, stop backseat steering! I can't help it, I'm getting horse sick. It's gaining on us! No offense, but you could use a little practice. First time on a horse here! You try to knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. I turn around to see if it's gaining, but it's all I can do to hold on. <sighs> Awesome. 
Yeehaw! Uh, Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. Uh, we made it. We actually freaking made it. Jesse, Gabriel was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Hey, how are you feeling? I... I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel! It really is you! Oh, I knew if anybody could outrun death, it would be you! Uh, who are you people? It's me! Eligard! Come on! Old friend, don't you recognize us? It's Soren. We've known each other for a very long time. <sighs> what a terrible turn of events. You! You're the one who rescued me! Tell me, please, what is going on? I remember only blackness. And then, suddenly you were there. And then we were galloping. All that matters is, you're safe now. You're among friends, Gabriel. I don't feel safe. All I feel is the horror of being in that monster. It was dark and foul, and I was sure I was a goner. Well, you aren't. You made it back alive. Which is more than I can say for some of us. <sighs> Magnus. For a second there, I almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Magnus? I still can't believe he's gone. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone! All I know is he'd want us to keep fighting no matter what. And for us to keep blowing the crap out of stuff. <laughs> You're right. He would. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? The Formidabomb just wasn't strong enough. I mean, it ripped the Witherstorm apart, but it didn't make a dent in the command block. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one Witherstorm to three. Our plan was a total failure. I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. So is the command block controlling all three Witherstorms? Oh, uh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? <sighs> I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? You have no idea. That jacket! I recognize it! Lucas always wears that jacket. No. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster! Ugh. It hurts just to think about. Just put it out of your mind. Jesse, if what Gabriel said is true... I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but... Lucas, your friends could still be out there! I know, and that means I... I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Whoa. I suddenly feel really dizzy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. I wish I could say the same for everyone else. Gravel? No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. But I can't leave them alone out there. You're right, they do need you. And the best way to help them? is to help us beat that monster. That sounds right, but it just doesn't feel right, Jesse. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. 
They do it for me. Same way you'd go back for any of your friends. I can't believe I'm saying this, but if your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them. And then I'll find you again, too. I promise. Thanks. Leftover cobblestone might come in handy. Not gonna lie, but we've dealt with worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse, who is this person? She keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend, the next I'm being made fun of. I keep telling you, I'm Eligard. And how do I know this woman exactly? I sense we have a history, but I feel I need a little reminder. She's your friend. She's been your friend for a very long time. Really? Really? You go way back. It isn't working. He doesn't remember anything. Talk to him about your past, something only you would know about. Hmm. What? We haven't seen each other for so long. I don't know what would even help. I suppose I could talk about the time we stayed up for a week straight trying to wire an ocelot taming machine. Really? Why did we do that? Because Magnus dared us to. And you were never one to turn down a dare. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. You'll get your chance, Gabriel. This fight isn't over yet. Very well. Now then, tell me another story. Oh, I'm not even sure where to start. Petra, how are you doing? You feeling any better? Better is relative. If I just sit here and don't move or breathe, it's almost bearable. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it, that all I cared about was getting that stupid diamond. This isn't your fault. It's Ivor's. Who wouldn't do something stupid for a diamond? But without my help, Ivor wouldn't have... Wouldn't have wanted revenge on Gabriel? Believe me, he would have found another way. Still, I'm gonna do everything I can... Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear, but you're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not going to make it. No. No way. I'm not a quitter. Petra, you need to keep fighting. There's no time to sit around relaxing in some cave. Jesse. Thanks, Jesse. Knew you'd understand. Just give me a little time to catch my breath, and I'll be fine. This is a bad idea, Jesse. Yeah, well, it's Petra's call to make. <laughs> Sorry, Reuben. I don't really feel like company. <laughs> Reuben! Just don't tell Reuben I said that. He might get jealous. Reuben! 
Men! Don't run off on me like that, okay? I hope Gabriel will be okay. I mean, he's supposed to be Gabriel the Warrior, but instead he's... you saw. Yeah, I guess none of the Order are how we imagine them. The world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. That's what I said, isn't it? Oh, just as you once helped us before. This isn't about the past, it's about the future. There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. So take responsibility for one, Soren. I did that by locking the command lock away. If only you could use it. Oh, do you still not realize how dangerous it is? Soren the Architect. I do not need lectures from you. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? Haven't you done enough, Ivor? Like, say, single-handedly destroying the entire world? Well, technically I set in motion a series of events whose end result appears to it's be... It's the same thing! What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? Yes, Sorry. That amulet. Oh, don't be so dramatic. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, oh, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. Withers gaze passed over them, and they went wild. Soren, do you think Enderman could actually destroy one of those things? Well, it's not beyond imagination. If there were enough of them working together, it's a promising concept, at least in theory. If I'm seeing all the pieces correctly. There's probably more than enough of them taking refuge in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas... Hush, Ivor, for once! Ugh. Question is, how to bring the Storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not for mere mortals. The Witherstorms are already chasing us. If we just get them to chase us to your fortress again... Yes! Yes, that's it! They'll be caught between a rock and a hard place. If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block. Ugh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a Formidabomb. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block, you mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, for just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. Ivor, how could you keep this secret? Oh, believe you me, keeping secrets is easy. So I made something. An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon. And you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it! It could very well solve all our problems. 
What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? found us so quickly. It just keeps coming for us. Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. So what do we do? We need to get out of here right now. Ivor says that if we don't, that thing will... Ivor? Well, I'll be. It is you. A pleasure, as always, Eligard. Hello. My name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. Anyway, Ivor's figured out that Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three Witherstorms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm going with him. I appreciate that. Jesse, I'm going with him too. Like you said, I need to keep fighting. Well, I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. But Lucas is out there all by himself. There's nothing you can do for him now. Everyone, take good care of yourselves. You too. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The redstone wrap? You got it. <laughs> I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. Much further. further now.
right? No. No, we're not even close. Profoundly sore. Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Hold on, back up. What exactly are the Far Lands? Are you being serious? The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Guys, we can't turn back now. Not after coming so far. Fine, but I'm taking a break. So am I. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> Potato, you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I think they say that. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. I'll keep watch. Just be quick about it. A potion of leaping. Cool. An entire cake. Nice. <laughs> ah! Ivor? Jesse! We need assistance! Hey! You! Witch! Everyone, let's get out of here ASAP! Ivor said the Far Lands are just past the swamp. Wait, where is Ivor? I thought he was with you. I don't know. He disappeared outside the witch's hut. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! <laughs> Got 
guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that? Oh. Wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. Glad Jesse snagged this cake. Makes the whole wall of insanity thing a lot easier to face. Say what you like about witches. They sure know how to make a cake. Hmm. Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. This wall. Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Incredible. You can say that again. How can Ivor live here? I mean, it's one thing to build a wool world inside the end, but this... Oh, I doubt he lives here. He most likely comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if the rest of our group was with us. Come on! Is this... a maze? It would appear so. A massive one, from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or... I don't know. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that Ivor built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. Ivor needs to take better care of this place. climb these. Everyone, on guard! There's too many! We can't fight them all! Who needs to climb when you have a potion of leaping? <laughs> Guys, climb the vines! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there.
I first met Ruben near a waterfall like this. I hope the little guy's okay. Ivor's lab. Wish it was a little closer. Safe to say, the Far Lands are strange. This place just gets weirder and weirder. Yikes! Shoot! You have got to be kidding me.
Olivia! some redstone dust handy and a slime ball I don't see a way across I wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Any sign of the others? Not yet. This maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the Dream Team reunited. <laughs> now the Dream Team's just gotta find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side, but it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, I'll help you. How are you gonna help me when I don't even know where to start? This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. 
I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. So prove her wrong. Show the world what you're made of. Prove her wrong? Jesse, she's the greatest redstone engineer ever. She's in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right, just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name. None of them give Eligard any respect. And Magnus lost his life trying to fight this. The Order can't do this. How are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. The Order of the Nothing. You know what? We're better than them. Better than the Order? I don't know about that. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Something that actually matters. Yeah, I can't either. Then again, maybe this is our chance. Ah, all right, I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. sooner the better. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. <laughs> Everyone okay? For the moment. I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> Soren, is that true? Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia. Well, that was exciting. 
Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. How to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew? Potionology, volume 24? None of these are enchanting books. A Brief History of Cubism. Crafting for Noobs, Revised. A Collector's Guide to Precious Gems. None of these seem to be enchanting books either. Learn to stop worrying and love mining. The unabridged redstone encyclopedia. Zombies and pigs and intimate memoir. I think I'm in the wrong part of the house. Wood planks, those will be useful. Makes sense that Ivor would have a crafting table. Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. First, I'll need some sticks. Okay, got the sticks. There we go, good old fashioned lever. was made for it, which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits. More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there! We'll head down and see what we can find! Whoa! What is all this? Ha! Huh, incredible! He's gathered them all in one place! Gathered what, exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. 
maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. These gas tiers? They're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Oh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? Am I crazy, or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. Oh, we were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? Sorry, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh, alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery! Aha! A hopper! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Looks like a regular hopper that's hooked up to a bunch of redstone circuitry. Man, Ivor sure does love his puzzles. Huh, five slots. Prismarine crystals into the hopper. Sea Lantern, in you go. Ender Dragon. Gassed Tears. Let's try them here. Huh, those were the right objects, but I guess it was the wrong order. possible combinations. Everything I needed was in your stories. Nice work, Jesse. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. By the stars, the Ender Dragon. With replica ender crystals and all. Wow. I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm. No way out.
Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. We're missing something here, Soren. And I have a feeling the key might be locked in that head of yours. I have a key locked in my head? What I'm saying is, I think you need to tell me about the Ender Dragon battle. Oh, huh. if only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so, the Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Wow. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. You did all that? Indeed I did. They didn't call us the Order of the Stone for nothing. I wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? Hmm, interesting. There's another door? Soren, tell me the story again. Certainly. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Uh, sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well, all right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? Better. Thanks. Hey, Reuben, give me a boost, will ya? <laughs> No, it, it can't be. Not here. But those things were destroyed in your big heroic battle with the Ender Dragon, right, Soren? He kept them. The fool actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore he was going to dispose of them. Soren, you said destroying these crystals was the key to defeating the Ender Dragon. You did kill the Ender Dragon, right? Jesse, this isn't... this isn't what it looks like. Our story. Uh, the story. It's... it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. So what really happened, Soren, if you didn't destroy the Ender Crystals? I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I think it's time to start talking. Uh, 
I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jess. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it, it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. We didn't even try. Soren just spit it out. What happened? You want the truth? We used that damned command block! You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. Understand. When I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster. We could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. <laughs> Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon. And the rest is history. Soren, you cheated. You, you worse than cheated. You're a fraud. Believe me. I know. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? Ivor. How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? But Ivor, why? You knew about all of this, didn't you, Ivor? Of course I knew about it. I was in the Order from the very beginning. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. How conniving of us. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on his own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. Yes. I suppose they do. Ivor, you're a madman! In all your scheming to expose the Order, you've nearly destroyed the known world! Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart! For a moment, I nearly forgot. Which brings us back to why we're here. We need to destroy that command block. Like now! Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. This thing better work, because if it doesn't... You don't need to say it. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor? I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well... It doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. Let's see, there's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamond score! So, I can craft whatever I want, huh? 
anything at all. And guess I could cr a pickaxe, a shovel. Awesome! I've never owned a diamond weapon. Just wait till you enchant it. Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Behold! My enchanted diamond sword! Yes, that should do the job nicely. But if you're fighting those wither monsters head on, you'll want better armor too. I enchanted these for the order. They're about as strong as it comes. Even able to withstand TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. And believe me, they're all excellent. All right, let me take a look at them. It's all quite durable and sturdy. They won't stop damage, but they'll help. All right, this is the set. Yes, a fine choice. Now go ahead and put it on. How do I look? Ready for action. You can take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Witherstorms are doing against those Endermen. Oh, my poor fortress. I see Endermen, so this means the plan's working, right? Shouldn't the Endermen have dismantled those things by now? Or am I just confused? It's not just you. Something's wrong. Jesse, over here! Axel! Petra, you're okay! You guys made it! Nice freaking armor, by the way. Hey, Petra. Are you alright? No. I'm barely hanging on. I should have stayed in that cave. Except you saved my butt like a dozen times. He's exaggerating. I found a couple potions to keep me going. Yeah. But I'm all out. Coulda, shoulda, woulda. We're here now. Jesse's gonna destroy that thing and make you better, Petra. Might not be as easy as you think. The Endermen, they're not angry enough. I mean, some of them are, but a lot of them are just standing around moving blocks. You know, being Enderman. Ah, black. They've kept the main wither storm busy, but one of the smaller ones started attacking us. Yeah, so Eligard ran off to fight that thing all by herself. She's fighting a wither storm alone. Yep, kept saying something about paying for the mistakes of the past, whatever that means. If a fellow member of the Order of the, of the uh, Order of the Stone is out there fighting, then I belong out there too. Gabriel, no, no, I told you you're not who you think you are. My name is Gabriel the Warrior. And he's running the wrong way. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm not letting that idiot get himself killed. Gabriel, come back here. <sighs> Without the command block, none of them stands a chance. Say what now? Why do they need the command block? Trust me, you don't want to know. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. Um, okay. <coughs> Jesse, guys, I can't do this anymore. You need to go on without me. What? No. As hard as I could, but... Petra, we need you. This is it. The final fight. I know how bad you want me there, but I just can't do it. Please, just destroy that command block for me. Believe me, I will. 
So what's the plan? I mean, I know we gotta go in there, but do we just go for it or what? We need to find a way for me to use this. Whoa. That is, without question, the coolest thing I have ever, ever seen. Me too. Nice, Jesse. Oh, and I brought you some armor, Axel. Here. Nice! I was feeling a little left out. Guys, let's go kick some command block butt. see the command block? We need to get more Endermen focused on the Winter Storm! How do you make Endermen focus? I can't even make myself focus. We, we shouldn't be here. None of this is going according to plan. Soren, what are you doing? I, uh, you know, I've, I've really enjoyed meeting you all, but... Soren! Did Soren just run away? Soren, you coward! I can't believe you! So much for the mighty Order of the Stone. It doesn't matter. We have work to do. We need to get those Endermen to attack it! The tractor beam! Jesse, that's it! Make them chase you into the tractor beam! They're falling for it. Axel, are those snowballs? Yeah, I found them near the cave. Here. All right, let's see how you like this. Uh-oh. That's right, come and get me. Ruben, can you give me a little help? <laughs> nice one, Ruben! need to find you a way up. Or build you a way up. That's it. E everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see. I've got redstone and cobblestone from Ivor's armory. I have some TNT from Boomtown. I've got pistons, repeaters, some wool, some leftover slime. Oh, and I still have that minecart. That's got to be enough to make something, right? I mean, if we use the TNT on, say... The minecart? Or those pistons. And we do have all that cobblestone. Guys, check it out. Use the pistons, the redstone, and the TNT. Build a TNT launcher. And I climb on, and you guys blast me all the way into the Witherstorm. <laughs> Heck yeah! I love that idea. 
So what are we waiting for? Let's hurry up and... Oh, look out! Ah! Axel! I got you! Lucas! You're here! Ocelots, distract that wither storm! Hey you! Get a load of this! <laughs> Lucas, thank you. Anything for a friend. Now let's hurry up and build this thing! You guys done yet? Just need a few more seconds. Okay, it's finished. Quick, climb on. And Jesse, I know you can do this. We all do. Thanks, guys. It means a lot. Now go demolish that command block. <laughs> Ruben, this is no place for us. Shouldn't have surprised me like that. On the other hand, I'm kind of glad not to be alone right here. Just stay close, okay? Oh, I recognize these people. Some weapon, don't fail me now. Here, Ruben. I mean it this time.
from. Ruben, I thought I told you to stay put. Beam. Hey, you! Reuben, I'll be fine. I'm gonna let it suck me all the way up. It's close enough to do what I have to do. Bet you can't catch me! I have to look down. No, 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 no! Ruben, I need your help! Remember how we used to play fetch? That's it! That's it! Come on, Reuben, I believe in you! Jump! I'll catch you! You did it! I knew I could count on you! Time to put an end to this thing once and for all. Reuben! Hold on, buddy! Jesse, are you all right? We thought you were... I mean, I didn't think you'd made it. Reuben, where's Reuben? I thought he was with you. Guys, look! My sickness is gone! Oh, Petra, I'm so happy for you. Hey, hey. Do you guys hear something? Reuben! Just help save the world. Come on, Reuben, say something. Reuben, don't do this to me. Jesse, I am... I am so sorry. He was a great pig. Thank you. 
People used to look at me like that once, Jesse. Having my memory restored has been both a blessing and a curse. Perhaps they deserve to know the truth about the Order. All those lies we told them. Maybe I should finally come clean. You're right. They do deserve to know. We all owe a great debt to Jesse and his friends. But I owe a debt to you people as well. Which is why... There is something I want to tell you. About the Order. The Order of the Stone is not what you all believed. We were frauds. We used the command block to falsify our legacy. We were no heroes. So it is time for the world to celebrate new heroes. Real heroes. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I know you think I'm up here because I saved the world or something, but the truth is I didn't do it alone. Far from it. You see, I, I also had my pig, Reuben. I could never have done this without him. He gave me advice, picked me up when I was down, and in the end, he saved every one of us. I'll really miss the little guy. We all will. Anyway, it's crazy to think my friends and I started out in a treehouse, and now we've been to some of the weirdest places in the world. I mean, come on, we went to the end. We even made friends with some Endermen, which is kind of a long story. But when all was said and done, you know what really mattered? Finishing what we set out to do. Because there's no way we were going to let a world this cool get torn apart. We did it! Jesse, this nether star is all that remained when the wither storm was destroyed. Would you please do the honors? Oh man, this is gonna be so cool. Introduce to you the new Order of the Stone. And so it was that a new Order of the Stone was born, one whose adventures were only just beginning. For though the world had been saved, and the command block destroyed, there are many more worlds than just this one. 